Hi everyone, my name is Stephanie and I am an as-needed adult services librarian at Santa Clara City Library. Today I am going to be showing you how to create a hydro dipped cup using nail polish. Let's go ahead and begin. We are now going to review our supplies. As you can see, there is a bowl in front of us that is lined with a plastic trash bag. The bowl is filled with water and nothing else. Just make sure whatever you use is deep enough to dip a cup. The next thing you'll need is an area to use as a drying surface. I'm using a paper bag. The next thing you'll need are some toothpicks. I went ahead and used some kebab sticks that I had on hand and I cut them up. The next thing that you'll need is nail polish in a variety of colors. You'll also need cups or mugs. I'm going to be using some wine glasses that lost the decals that they had on the glass and I'm going to be trying to cover up that design. I am going to be starting off with the cool tone nail polishes that I have on hand. As you can see, it's just a matter of pouring the nail polish directly into the water. And then once you're done, you seal it up once again and then grab a different color. We are now going to speed through the process of adding a variety of colors. As you can see, a pattern will begin to form as you add more nail polish. We are now going to grab our kebab sticks and begin to gently pull at the nail polish that is floating at the surface of the water to create a design. We are now going to begin the process of dipping our glass. As you can see, I have my glass at a slight angle, which makes it easier for us to dip it. And we are going to begin to gently place it into the water and gently turn it. As you can see, I am gently tapping off the excess water and I am then going to show you what it looks like. Now that we've placed our glass on the side to dry, we are going to get rid of the excess nail polish floating in the water with our kebab stick. And we are going to place that to the side. We are then going to repeat this process with our warm tone nail polish. I'm going to go ahead and speed through this example. As you can see, our blue glass has dried up quite a bit, and this is what it looks like. Regarding care for the glasses, you are able to wash them with soap and water, and the nail polish should not come off. Thank you for watching this video. We encourage you to participate in our summer reading program. Stay tuned for more craft and cooking tutorials online. Have a great day.